Well, I remember them telling me that they were going to put their bells and whistles on to get me there a bit quicker, so they only really do that when they get a little bit nervous, so I guess I wasn't in great shape. I sort of have vague recollections of being wheeled into their admission area for, uh, for emergency cases and some tests being done. And I think then they perhaps told me that I'd had a stroke or something like that, but I, it didn't really register with me that night. I think I was, by the time that was finished and, and they wheeled me upstairs, I'd had enough for one day and I just wanted to have a rest. In AVERT, we're really targeting that very early time window, the first day and days after someone has a stroke. And our main question is, how can we help people recover better? The reason AVERT's been done at this stage is the clinical practice guidelines have suggested a variety of ways of looking after stroke patients in these first few days, but they don't have any reliable scientific evidence on which to base their advice. So we really need um, reliable clinical trials to underpin the best advice. This study is the largest collaborative trial ever conducted across five countries to determine how we should approach early rehab with a mobility focus after stroke. We compared two different models of care, usual care in a stroke unit, which started early but with a lower dose of out-of-bed intervention, and very early mobilisation, which started within 24 hours with a much higher dose of out-of-bed intervention supported by nurses and physiotherapists working together. I do remember that first day the physios came, God bless them, and um, suggested that it might be good if I stood up. They tried to get me on the move pretty quickly, and initially I wasn't that keen, but I think in retrospect it was probably a good thing. You actually need to do very big trials to be confident about your results. And then that leads on, you need to do these trials in many different hospital sites and sometimes in many different countries. This is where AVERT's been unique, taking the trial to over 50 different hospitals in several different countries so that we can be sure that the answer applies in the broadest way possible. It's great research and I hope something really valuable will come from it. So I was really happy just to play a small part and I reckon it's terrific because it's just, it's another facet of life and it's really interesting to, to be involved in any way. The value of conducting this trial won't be fully realised for some time. It's hard to estimate what kind of effects we'll have uh, and there's much more that we need to look at. But the high quality of the trial and the comprehensive nature of the information we've gathered is a real testament to uh, the commitment of the patients and their families, the hospital staff and the research staff who've been involved. It's really been a magnificent effort. My goal was to try and get better as quickly as I could, get back to doing everything that I had done as quickly as I could.